Hi there, I'm Ilya and I'm delighted to speak at your conference. Sorry I'm not there in person and I hope the weather at your place is much better than here. I work at Maps.me, helping them improve the most popular application based on OpenStreetMap. Most of you should know it and if you don't, uh, then please go to your App Store and install it. It's pretty great. So, for a few years ago we added an editor to Maps.me and uh, it is still pretty great. We just click on a point in offline and you can add open hours or add a missing shop and so on. And the thing was, uh, for a long time we didn't get any feedback about editor. People were just using it for adding some small things and we didn't hear a word. But then Tanzania helped. Uh, Janet uh, Chapman came, came to me and asked for a few modifications in Maps.me, like filtering categories, uh, adding Swahili translations, uh, some small things here and there. And uh, she got a custom build. And to this moment, uh, Tanzania built it the only custom build supported by us. And I look at the categories and thought, uh, what can you do with just 20 of these? And turns out, pretty much. I looked at numbers and turns out Tanzania is the second most active African country after Algeria in Maps.me. And the country has seen more changes from Maps.me uh, than the Netherlands or the whole of United Kingdom. And there is a metric by, by which uh, Tanzania is in top three. That's the uh, average number of edits per user. The worldwide average is 10, but in Tanzania it's 34 edits. It's uh, second only to North Korea, which has 38 edits per user. But I think I can guess who that user is. So, most of you know about the editor. Uh, I won't uh, be talking about it and I think Janet can do much better introduction. But the editor is quite complex inside, and I think I can help with some less known features. For example, opposite map nodes. Turns out that in 40 edits in Tanzania, only one is uploading an opposite map node, and that is much less than in other countries. But nodes can be helpful, for example, in mapping unusual things, things there are no category or a field for. To add a node, just click on an amenity and enter AT mode or long tap on an empty field and uh, press create a place and scroll down to the uh, advanced description field. Words that you type in the advanced description uh, are not sent as a part of an object, they are sent as an OpenStreetMap node. And later you can browse your notes and uh, improve the map accordingly in a much uh, more advanced editor like JOSM or ID. Also, imagine you have spent all the day collecting data offline and then you come home or to the place with Wi-Fi, your phone is connected and how do you upload these edits? Because Mapsmith doesn't have an uh, upload button. Uh, the secret is, you start the application and then you close it with the back or home button. And at the moment the application is closed, uh, edits get sent to OpenStreetMap. And if you don't see your new object on OpenStreetMap uh, website, you can open the search panel and type question mark edits. You will see the list of edits and the reason for not uploading them. Uh, it's December now, and in December we usually add many cool features to Maps.me. Like, for the past two months I've been working on adding subway routing uh, to Maps.me. But I guess that won't be of much use in Dar es Salaam. Also, there are comments. Uh, I already pushed them. Uh, if you have latest version of Maps.me, uh, just tap on an amenity or a shop and you will see icons for your rating, from bad to best, and a button for adding a review. And in that you should write anything that shouldn't go to OpenStreetMap.
like some relative quality or venue or dishes you should try out in a restaurant or uh, write about your experience at a hairdresser's. So go and try this feature and uh, that will help uh, not only you but anyone in your city. We are also adding local experts feature. Uh, it's when you register as a local expert and then tourists uh, can pay a small fee uh, for your services like uh, walking around town or visiting uh, some unusual attractions or just for a chat and a beer. Uh, that uh, might be useful for some of you as well as uh, local ads feature. It's when uh, you promote your business on the map so it's more prominent than others. And finally, uh, uh, for the next months we plan to improve many long-standing features like uh, bookmarks or navigation or, or the editor. So, if you have any suggestions for improvements of these, uh, write us by email. It's uh, bugs at maps.me. We all receive emails from that address. So, it was a pleasure to speak to you. Thank you and have a nice conference. Bye.